Hello once again and today we're going to change the registered name and account user name in Windows 10. First things first, we got a change to from an email account to a local account before you can proceed to change the registered name. Right, what we do, we do um, go to start, then go to settings, then accounts. Right, so now th this has to be changed. Um, sign in with a local account in instead. So, current password. Okay, I've got that saved, so you go click next. Uh, switch your local account, type in a name there, using the name you're going to use. And click next. Sign out to finish, shut it out and finish, preparing your local account. Um, yeah, it's quite simple. So now the computer is going to restart. Um, so I think we just click back in and as you can see, it's changed to sign in. You can put a password in if you want. And that's how you change to a local account from an email account, as simple as that. And now we're going to proceed to the next step. Right, now we've um, changed to a local account. Now we can get on with changing the registered name. So first things first, you click on your search and you type in WinThe. Click on that and you can see it's currently is Dave's, but we want to change that. So then we go through this, right. First thing we do is type in regedit.exe, click on that, click yes, then what we do, click on that, but it's already open so we don't have to worry, then you click on software, Microsoft, which is there, then you look down for Windows NT. There we are, Windows NT, current version. Then you come over here and you look for um, registered owner, which is here, registered owner. Double click on that and we can change that to whatever name you desire. So in my case, I'm just gonna type in John. Click OK and that will be done. So we wanna confirm that, so we double check by click it by typing win first again and there we go we can see it's changed but that's not all that's not all um, now we got to um, change the actual login when it logs in um, so so we type in control well find your control panel um, add um, user accounts rather and you click on user accounts again change your account name as you can see it's currently Dave but now we're going to change it to John change name and that's all done so next thing you do restart your computer and when it um, comes back up you'll see your original name, what was already on there, will change to your new name. As we can see, the name has changed. So that just tells you it all works and that's how you do it. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. Till next time and goodbye.